Hello everybody and welcome back to Satisfactory with me, your host, Parallax. So what are we doing today? Um, well, I really, really, really want to move computer production up one level, but if you look, we just don't have enough plastic. We really don't. Um, this is with every single plastic producer like out there where the oil fields are we have almost all of them making plastic i think there's only one or two left making rubber and the thing that sucks is we're not even using the rubber like the rubber we're, we're having to sell it to the grinder because we're not even using it so even if we do build even if we do move the computer production up this way and we will eventually we're not going to be able to produce any computers because we're not going to have any plastic so, and I think you need something like four or five computers per um, supercomputer. So, so we need to go hunting for more oil. The only bad thing is, it kind of feels like there's this huge wall, like right here in the game right um we've pushed down far over here but but that right there we had to vertically ascend quite a long way to to get there and over here i think we can get up to this area but i think it's enclosed i'm not i'm not done a lot of exploring over there but i think i think that's it's an enclosed area so to hunt for fuel i think i want to go up this way and move out here and to that end i'm going to go build the um the little exploring how much fuel do i have in my pocket by the way i have 183 um let's just let's build it and let's 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 drive it for a little bit and let's see how much fuel it's going to take 100 fuel probably seems like enough to go on arranging but i just don't know okay transportation you got you the explorer i need more beacons to make this happen I need more beacons. I can make 75 beacons out of my pocket. Perfect. I think I needed 15. There we go. So now let's get someplace. Let me make sure I can build it first. Can I build it? I can. So let's make sure we get someplace. We're going to be able to drive this thing out. I don't want to put it up there on that. But I just don't know if that's drive outable. Whatever that whatever they're guarding over there, I haven't I haven't gone in there to check. Oh, they're they're guarding one of those slugs. Okay. Um Don't want any part of that. I think I want to go over there. You see that? I think that's where I would like to go. I'd like to go explore that area. All right, let's build it here. Let's build it here and let's just kind of see what we get. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't mean to hear my throat in your ear. There's the workbench. Yes, yes. Where's the... Uh, Where's the fuel tank at on this bad boy? Where's the fuel tank at here? Yeah, we don't have any. We don't have no power. I understand that. Where is the fuel? Where do you put fuel in here? All right, we'll open the workbench. Okay, that's right. Vehicle. Oh, there it is. There it is. There's there's the fuel tank. Okay. All right. There's 100 fuel. Oh, gear up, son. Gear up. There it is. Oh no. Oh no. That's that's. 
He went like 10 feet and got stopped. And we're aggroing every single one of the bot fly nests. Ah, no! Nine! Okay, good. No idea what's out this way. I need more oil. That's what we're looking for. We need more oil because we need more plastic. If we run across uh, hard drives, that would be fantastic. We haven't had a hard drive deal in a while. You know, I just got I got to check something just right quick. Hold on here. When I um the monitor that I use out here in the vacation home, it actually is Okay, we're good. Let's like say it's actually a uh it's actually a 4K monitor out here. I just want to make sure that the game didn't like run up to 4K. Ooh. Not far away at all. Let's go check that out. It's only one though. I like that other site. It had three. Okay, what do we have here? Some iron? Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Reloading. Disgusting. Interesting. Look at this place. Look at this place. Yeah, if that's not freaking terrifying, I don't know what is. This game does a real good job with scope. Come on. Alright, I see you all the way over there, huh? Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Okay, you stay here. Let me go figure this out. What's that? A copper? I don't even want it. I don't even want it. I don't even want to mess with that. Let's see what I can do here. A little slug there. I wonder if it wouldn't be more beneficial to go down and be on the floor. What is it, R? Never no, R Zoopsis. Uh, maybe I can build it from there out. I still love this. Watch. All you have to do is click it and then drag it, and it it moves up. Like the <clears throat> it moves up to the to the height you need it to be. Isn't that wonderful? Oh. Another flying mantis thing. A lot of those things around. And where was that oil one more time? I feel like over there. Yep. So now... This way. Now how are we going to bridge that gap, I wonder? Come on. You won't let me build. Um, I do have the jetpack. I don't think I can build while in the jetpack, though. Um, well, let's do... Can we do the opposite? we do the opposite? Can we, um... Yeah, let's see if we can start here. And then go down. Okay. And then the trick is just to get rid of that one. And maybe just have a small... Like that, maybe? That makes sense. 
Uh, sorry, the autosave is gonna is gonna hiccup us a lot. I almost bought it. I almost pulled my trigger yesterday and 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 got the uh, the the three eighty. Uh, I told the wife. The wife was super mad. She was like, "Do not, do not buy that." So I went ahead and like put it in the cart. Ladies, let that be a lesson to you. We don't we don't think I don't I, I, I anytime I I get a challenge I I like to rise to the challenge. You know. <laughs> If you ever want me not to do something, just be like, oh, yeah, yeah, go ahead. You deserve it. And I'll be like, oh, man, I don't. I shouldn't, you know. Anywho, I was almost going to hit the button until I saw that it was going to be delivered on July the 1st, which is a month away. And I was like, no, nine. Not going to happen. Oh, there are two here. There's a nice. Oh, there's three. There's three here, just like the other place. I love that. Um, what else I love? How do you do this? Also love. It. Oh no! Please don't hurt me. <laughs> You're supposed to die. I didn't get any of them. That guy's still alive. I can hear him. There he is. There's the oil. Well, that was a insanely easy way to take care of that problem. Uh, yeah. So there's the oil. Oh, there's the other oil, too. Groovy. Love that. Love it. I didn't see another, um, is that the other oil over there? That is the other oil over there. Cool. All right. We have oil. And I think what we'll do is we'll pump this oil. Probably. No, 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 no. Because it'll be easier to move uh, plastic back than it will to bring liquid back. So we'll, we'll process it, process this on site. Just like we did the other place. Um... Probably should have made sure I had a bunch of stuff before I came out here. Can I get three? Yes, I can. All right, beautiful. So I'll take that pointed this way. There's one over there. I guess I'll have it pointed. He knows. No bullet drop in this game. Incoming. Perfect. Okay. Now have that just pointed out that way. Probably no, probably point out that way. Okay. Now, let's get some numbers here. This produces 60 a minute. I think my refineries... How many of these can I make? I think I need to make like nine. I think it's three per deal. So I'm going to need more motors. I'm going to need more Copper, and I'm going to need more steel pipe. And then I'm going to need... Yeah, I have a lot of that. Some of that in my deal. That's perfect. I'm going to want probably one or two of those. Eh, maybe let's just do one. Um, I'll have to run back and grab some stuff, obviously. And then conveyor belt. Do I want to do conveyor belt or do I want to do train? Conveyor belt or train to bring the plastic back. Uh, I really like doing conveyor belts, but driving all this way, I think driving has kind of made me think that it's a lot closer than it is. So I think I need to do. I think I need to do. Um, 
I think we're gonna need to do train. Let's do train, because train is gonna be able to produce a lot, a lot, a lot of plastic is gonna be made out here at this site. And the train does a real good job of um of moving vast quantities. So let's go ahead and start building the uh where we're gonna start uh processing all this oil. I'm gonna go ahead and just do this. I know that I'm low on concrete and I know I'm low on metal plate, but at least I'm not gonna be taking back building components with me, you know what I mean? Like I'll be I'll be spending all those building components here, so I'm not like walking them back and then having to like bring more of it back. I'm gonna go ahead and build what I got. Then a refinery. I'll do the same same argument with a refinery. I'm gonna go ahead and put down what I can. Just so when I come back, these are already here. Um that's the input and output, right? Let me go right here. And that was it. I can only build the one. Okay. And then pipe. I've only, see, I've only got like 84 of this stuff. I don't have a lot. See I'm, already, see, I'm already out of building material. There we go. Okay, cool. Um, what about... Nope, oh, can't even do that. Now, that that is a mark. Yeah, I can't even do those. Okay, cool. Let's go all the way back home. And then... Yeah, I really should have... I know, I know. Should have used my, my deal on the right-hand side before I ran out. I didn't think I was going to be able to find it this easy. I was kind of hoping... Uh, I was kind of hoping that uh, I'd run across a hard drive or something. Because I saw that there's a... Um, I saw that there's a recipe that you can get that'll take plastic out of the production. Oh, look at that. Home's just over there. Interesting. Interesting. Well, we could be send the train off that way. Yeah, this this game is real weird. Like the map situation, and everything. It just it's it's weird to me because I can't figure out. And maybe maybe it's because I played so many games that give you a mini map. Um, but it's really hard for me to understand like where stuff is. There's a giant. That and the topographical map hurts. So you would think that all that is on the same level. Come down through here. Yeah, look at that. That's a long haul. But that's a... Look at that. We can go out here. When, when we leave, we'll leave through the train station out here. And we'll try, to, we'll try to lay the train track like that where my cursor is going. Instead of coming over here to this because this is... That, look, that looks pretty involved. We'll go back the way we came, though. Probably. Hopefully. It would have been cool to have the train go around that pillar, though. I've been watching a... Uh... <clears throat> Sorry, I don't mean to... I have water here. I should just drink the water. I've been watching a YouTuber for a long time named Devil Dog. And that guy, uh, he got COVID. Him and his family did, actually. His wife and two kids. His two kids had to go to the emergency room. Um, this is nothing that he told me personally. This is stuff that he talked about on his channel, so don't think I'm being weird. But uh, he hasn't gotten over it. Uh, he was streaming a couple of days ago and he had to stop because his voice was getting so bad and he couldn't like, he couldn't even yell. And, uh, there was a part that he was like, oh, this isn't, 
Man, that autosave, it just wrecks my machine. Um, there was a part where he was saying, like, oh, this is not COVID, this is just bronchitis, or it's pneumonia, or I got another cold. I tell you, folks, do you get that, that long COVID, whatever they talk about, that, uh, yeah, look at that. That's There's the conveyor belt system. It's not too terribly far away. It's about halfway. Huh. We might be able to do conveyor belts. I like conveyor belts more than I like doing trains because a conveyor belt gives consistent um, delivery of, of the plastic. I'm gonna hop out and grab some of these right, right quick. I just, I need them. Oops. Oh yeah, that, what's our fuel at? 89? Yeah, this thing's a, this thing's great. Good gas mileage. I'm kind of devil bug right there. Could have went the rest of my life without knowing they were so close. To the base. Hey, but they did push us toward a uh, a crash site. That's super duper nice of them. I've only got uh, 12 rounds, so this fight here is going to suck. Oh, it's you. I thought it was the fighters. I thought they had followed us. Oh. Very happy that they did not. I'll tell you what. Let's go ahead and put the jetpack. Just so we can get up here. Reloading. Get some modular frames. Grab a couple of computers. Maybe this is going to just require some, uh, that's some screws. Nice. Let's see what you require. Oh, he needs some modular frames. Lovely. Ah, and a hard drive. Man, that's great. Super wonderful. More screws down there and something else. Oh, more frames. Perfect. Lovely. Um, but you get that long COVID stuff and that just, ugh. I've heard so many people just talk about how they cannot shake it. You know, they'll wake up and they'll feel okay and they'll go off to work and then boom, it just comes right back. Miserable, miserable disease. But yeah, that doesn't look that bad. Um, we came all the way back in here to the, the back side of the base. We could definitely put a train terminal here if we want to. But I think, uh, who built that? That's disgusting. Um, but I think we're going to do conveyor belts. We'll take a bunch of train stuff with us just in case we can't make the train, the conveyor belt work. But I think we'll be okay. All right, let's go park this thing just right here. Let's go ahead and put the good backpack on. And let's go over here and uh, let's get some concrete. Let's get some motors. Let's get some... Uh, copper plates. Let's, let's go shopping, as they say. What a beautiful, what a beautiful setup. Look at that. That's our quick wire. Yeah. Yeah. I'm happy that we're making a, uh, some of the components. Not the components for phase four, but we're just making the, the, the stuff that gets us to the stuff for phase four. I have a lot of these. I don't even know how I'm going to drop them off. Yeah, all those are... Maybe I can give them to... Uh, these guys, I can drop them off here. Yeah, perfect. Probably all of them. There we go. Hooray! Look at that. That's going to mess things up for a little while. Oh, are they done? Yeah, finally. Remember how we had the one... Um, that one little hinky-dinky line set up? To, uh, to make screws? 
because it was the new re it was the new um, recipe, the one that used uh, steel beams. So funny. All right, that finally got done. Lovely. All right, uh, concrete, concrete right there. Let's take. Is there anything we can get rid of? Is there anything that we just doesn't need to be in our pocket? We don't need the rubber. Um, we can eat that. We can put that in, and then this right here, 11 of those. I just don't even need them. I would, probably shouldn't have done that because I don't need more rifle cartridges. Radio control unit. Silica, I don't need. Do need more of those. I don't need the heavy frame. I don't need the 25 light frames. I don't need 75 light frames. And those, I just don't need that. A lot of those. Oh, and what is this? Coal? Come on, give me a break. And then these things? Why do I have 400? <laughs> I don't even know. I, don't, I, I have a lot of those already. I'll just... Bye-bye. There we go. Okay, now give me three of these. Then I have 235 of those. I might want to take up just one or two more stacks. Go put that in there. Right, let's go eat some berries. Right, let's go do a hard drive. Takes 10 minutes. Perfect. That's in and done. We need copper sheets. But I think all the copper sheets we make, I think they leave. Yes. Oh, we do have a, 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 a reservoir of copper sheet. That's fantastic. I did not think that was the case. Okay. Motors. Motors is like one of the last things we made on the, the standard line here. Take three of those, put that back. Is that 50? Let's do 150 motors. All right, now over here, the old pipe. Yep. And then are those faders, saders? We might need to turn one of these saders over to rotors, to tell you the honest truth. Uh, take three of those. That back. You know what? I I will take. There we go. I'll take a whole stack of those. Then pipe, steel pipe. There we go. Have a reservoir of steel pipe. All right, cool. Now that is eight refineries, one industrial fluid buffer. Um, let's go ahead and spin up logistics belt mark four. How many of those? I can do six hundred of those, I guess. Go up by ten. I'm going, to, I'm going to try. I'm going to try to get... Yeah, yeah, I, I just... I have enough. I have enough. I have enough. As far as it goes, as far as it goes. And I'll just come back and grab more and then continue onward. Like, that's just... That's just all there is, that's, that's just all there is to that. I have 600. That's okay for right now. Uh, the pipe, I should be okay on. Any more pipe is not going to make a difference. That right there should be okay. And for a refinery, um, what's the byproduct of making plastic? I think just oil goes in. Oh, that's right. We're going we're to get more power out of this too because we're going to be we're going to be processing fuel. We'll be processing fuel. So this I think it takes six fuel generators. So we are going to need rubber. Ah, and we're going to need more motors. 
So fuel and then we're not even going to get we're going to need 10 of those. Yep, okay. So rubber and more motors. And then what else? Computers and heavy modular frames. Got it. Got it. More motors. Heavy modular frames are produced, I think, up here now. Yes. Are you produced up here? These heavy modular frames? Yeah, look at them all backed up. Love that. There's 18. I just take. Just to have some more in my pocket. So we're going we're gonna to use all of them. <laughs> Okay, take all those. And computer adoras. I'm going to go to the train station and snag those because I think there's many of them there. No, they're all in the south. I don't think there's going to be... Oh, 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 they're, they're bringing some. Or they're taking some. No. Stop, you fool. Take all. Ha, 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 ha. Ha 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 You have nothing. Uh -huh. And then I'll take all those too. Okay, perfect. And then the rubber. Let's go snag the rubber. La da 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 Cannot believe we're actually going to get rubber. Like I was just talking about at the beginning of this this video how we don't use rubber for anything here we are I'm getting in line oh poo poo you don't have any room those things I don't really need have on me let me go drop all this and then those I just don't need let's go drop some of this stuff off some of these computer um, circuit boards and all that jazz Were you the one that was holding? Yeah, we have tons of computers. You were doing computer circuit boards at one time. I probably could have put those computer boards. Maybe I could have distributed them evenly throughout there. You're doing the AI limiters, right? Yep, I'll put those there. And then who's doing the quick wire? Where'd the quick wire? Did I just run past them? No, no, no. Who's doing... Uh, where is the high speed... Where are the high speed cable, bypass cables being made? Are you guys high speed? Nope. That's odd. I thought I put something down here that did high-speed cables. Not you. You're the one. Oh, you are high-speed cables. Huh. You've been a snake. You'd have bit me. All right. Let's go grab the rubber. Da -da 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 -da. Rubber is down one floor. All to get more plastic. Ugh. What a pain in the booty. What a pain in the booty. There we go. All right, let's get out of here. I hope we're doing the right choice. I hope I hope uh, doing the conveyor belts the right idea. It would be cool to have another plane, or it would be cool to have a drone. That'd be kind of that'd be kind of cool. But I think I could bring I think I can bring the um, the conveyor belt system in. I think it'll be okay. I parked the car. There it is. Okay, and then let's turn on do that one again. Oh, oops, oops sorry. All right, let's get out of here. Back toward. So we want to go kind of through that forward. There's a bridge there, like a natural bridge. And then it looks like it, it goes down, doesn't it? It looks like there's a ramp right past the natural bridge. Oh, huh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
why? Why can't we just live in peace? Yeah, I, I, want, I know you want me to harvest, but number one, I don't think I have... Reloading. My last ten. Okay. I don't think I have room in my... I do. Wonderful. There you go. Your contract legally compels you to harvest this artifact. Not morally, though. Just legally. Alright, let's shag ass. Alright, here's the small river that we're forging. We set on the other side of it. We'll hang a right. Can I go under that? I can smash into a tree is what I can do. And another tree. And a rock. There we go. Now we go wagons east. Look at some jabroni just came out here and put a friggin' conveyor belt system everywhere. You can't even get past it. Who does that? Okay. Now there's like a little land bridge. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, the land bridge up here going through all that. Hold on. Let's let's do an experiment here. Yeah, reload. Okay, okay. okay. Yep, yep, I understand. Nope, permanent. <sighs> Disappointing. Um, yeah, I guess we just go off that way then. Not that big a deal. I wanted to go across the bridge though. Oh, I am. I am. Okay. So go across land bridge. Which is right here. And then, right after you go across land bridge, hang a left. The pillar. After the pillar, right? Hey, buddy. Hey, guys. Something's there. Is that coal? Kind of a natural ramp there. Kind of works. Kind of works. Okay, come out to the Badlands. <gasps> Another crashed ship. That's really good. Yeah, he's not. Only got three rounds, but, you know. It's one of the big boys. Heal up a little bit. Where'd you go? Okay, now I just gotta get the fireflies situated. One left. Got him. <clears throat> All right. Woo. Unfun. Oh, there's a motor here. I'll take the motors. I'm about to spend all my money. Yeah, spend a lot of money on motors. Where's the uh, Where's the main body of the uh, the aircraft or the the spaceship? The one that would have the requires. Oh, I have. Oh, and it needs uh, power. Understood. Uh, we do have to run power here anyway. Uh, just put it right there then. Look that up. And then we're running power out to the refiner. Because I see where I'm, I'm supposed to be going right over there. So uh, when I run the power, I'll just remember to come out here and pick that up. All right. Vamanos.
Sorry about that autosave. I want that new graphics card, man. I want it so bad. I'd have had it too if it wasn't for July the 1st. It was $800. It was a 10 gigabyte 380 for $800, which is really good. Uh, I know that the 480s and, and the 400 line is coming out soon. Like, I know that that's going to happen. So I know that the prices are going to go down, but that's in September. So that's not, I mean, it's soon, but it's not like insanely soon. All right. Let's go look at this guy right quick. You make 60 oil a minute. And if I want you to make plastic, then you need 30 a minute. 60, 30. That's odd. I thought it was a 3 to 1 ratio. Why is it not a 3 to 1 ratio? Is it because I'm dumb and I can't remember things? Is that why? At 60. Huh. Interesting. There's not a uh, Mark II, is there? I gotta check my phone right quick. Nope. Um, not a Mark II, is there? No, nope, just oil extractor, not Mark One or Mark II. Oh, right there it says normal extraction rate is 120. Oh, these might not be pure. Impure. Yeah. Well, that's not bad because it's it, it's less work for me to do, and I don't need that. Oh, there's normal. There's 120. Okay. Okay. That one's impure. That one's normal. Got it. Got it. Got it. Perfect. Really? I didn't kill you the last time I was here. I have a sneaking suspicion I did. Maybe I did not. Maybe I just built it. And what are you? You are 60, so you are an impure source. Okay, got it. Got it. So, that's four refineries for those two. And then seven. So I need seven refineries here. And you are the good one. Uh, can I change the color of the pipe? No, I guess I have to have the painter thing for that. Um, let's go ahead and give myself a way up. Perfect. Lovely. I'm going to need to give myself a way to hook this stuff up too. But that's okay. Let's go ahead and start building again. Let's just do one more extra. There's a guy I watch uh, who bought a, and I guess what they what they did a long time ago in the Italian Alps, these people would live. Uh, toward the bottom of the mountain during the winter because the top of the mountain was just too cold and it was too unforgiving But in the summertime they would go up to the mountain because it was cooler up there And because it was easier to I guess raise the sheep that they had because the mountain I don't know like like pasture land. It was just easier for the sheep to to graze on the side of the mountain than it was for them to have to go and find a pasture at the bottom because they were poor, right? So they had to they had to buy that land or something, and it was a premium. But the mountain was cheap because no one wanted to live there. Anywho, one, two, three. So I'll do you. Make you happy. So one, two, three, four, and then that'll make other of the pump sites happy. It'll make. Why don't you, uh, oh, because there's a, yeah, there's a piece of land there. You can be squeezing in over here. And not, okay, so, dang. <laughs> we are one refinery away from doing this right. But that's not the biggest deal in the world. I guess we can just do this. Uh, 
Um, but I've been watching this guy who built it, and he's been re revitalizing it, like re like re like he lives in it now, and he he uh, goes through all the like he lives there, and he hasn't posted a video in a while, and I'm, I'm a little concerned. I'm concerned as to why he has it because it's, it's summertime over there now so i thought he'd be like he'd be you know super duper happy and giddy because he he really he complains a lot about the winter because it's cold it's cold i don't blame him at all i don't like being cold but the summer came and i thought he would just be making videos and building and working he's done a great job and like when i first when i first started the the series i was a little mad because he was doing things that I wouldn't do. Uh, he spent a lot of time building a baby cabin inside of his his house. So just imagine, like, there's the, the stone house, right? And then as you go inside the stone house, there's a cabin. <laughs> and I was like, why? Why did you spend so much time building a little cabin inside your home? Like, just make your home livable. You know, to me, an American, I was like, just, just put the drywall, right? Like, go through and... Uh, and get it ready for drywall. Frame it, I guess is what I'm trying to say here. Instead of building a little... I mean, that's what he did anyway. He framed it. He just didn't utilize all the space in the house uh, as it was. He was utilize, utilizing only maybe uh, four-fifths of the space. Which I know is, is pretty efficient, but, you know. Uh, hold on here. You got, you got one that you weren't supposed to get. Greedy... All right, you just get three. And you gentlemen are making plastic and making plastic and heavy crude. Plastic and heavy crude. Hey, okay. that guy over there, boop. You're going to come here just like that guy did. Come up on the platform just like that guy did. And you're going to go over just like he did. But you're only going to go over two. I know this is ugly. I know it's ugly. I'm so sorry. I'll do better. There's that one and there's that one. I'm not going to do better. I'm, I'm just going to keep making it ugly. <laughs> I'm at that stage where I kind of don't care anymore how things look. I mean, I want, them, I want them to look decent. I want it to be laid out where I can understand what's happening. But, oh, look at that. So nice. So nice. And I have to mess with killing those things. And this one... I guess what we could do is we could just well had I extended that we could have but I did not so we cannot oh, this looks bad All right, yeah, that does not look good. <laughs> that definitely is the worst of all the pipes. Okay. I don't even think it's gonna work either. I think that's too far off to the right. Oh, it does, it works. Wow, I would not have thought that. Would not have thought that at all. And then, perfect. And then with that one, I'm I'm going to go ahead and use the one, the one pump that I brought, or the two pumps that I brought. I just kind of feel like that's going to need to. This is going to need to happen. Put that there. You. You. Okay. Another one. You. 
Okay, and those two together. Lovely. Didn't bring a lot of cable with me, unfortunately. Be able to hook up this area, but I probably won't be able to hook up um, much more than that. Nice. That's great. All right. Now those are all pumping, or they will pump if they had electricity. You're making plastic and heavy, heavy whatever. You're making plastic and heavy whatever. You're making plastic and heavy crude. You've already been told what to do. Perfect. You've already been told what to do. Perfect. You've already been told what to do. Perfect. So have you. Lovely. Now on the other side here, let's see. You are going to be producing 10 heavy per minute. And there are four and uh, three and four. So there are seven of you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we know that we're going to be 70 crude oil out. So, uh, da, 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 da. let's go ahead and do this first. Okay. This out. Okay. Maybe I'm over engineering this. Maybe I don't need all this. You know what I mean? Like maybe I can just take a step back here and not have to produce so very much plastic. Ugh. I kind of want to say that and I kind of want to do that, but at the same time, I I'll, I kind of feel like I'm going to need I'm going to need more plastic. So why not go ahead and get this done? Okay, and you're going to go there. The next one, let's just go ahead and make it right here, just in case I don't have the, the reach. That one right there. That one right there. There we go. And then, let's hook that up. This is just going to be for the, the heavy crude that we're making 70 of a minute. And then I'm going to want that to turn around. I probably can't handle this the way I handle. And then let's make the more refineries and let's see how many we're going to need to process that heavy into fuel and then when that heavy gets turned into fuel we'll have to make the generators so let's see here nope not the fuel generator yet the refinery so it's going to turn that way that looks good we'll start right there Okay, my man. Sulfuric acid. Holy crap. Have I had to use that yet? Probably not. Liquid biofuel. <laughs> it's just water and biofuel. That's what liquid biofuel is. <laughs> Residual fuel. That's just fuel. Okay. So you. Because you're going to be... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You. So the heavy comes in at 60 per minute. Oh, we only need two. We only need two refineries because we're, we're generating 70. So we'll just need two. Perfect. And one won't even be, be running all that time or all that much. Perfect. Let's do another one of those. 
here. Lovely. And that auto save. You're the only thing that breaks the immersion, auto save. You slow us down. Get over here. I did not think I'd be out here today working on another refinery. Hopefully this is it. Hopefully this is all the plastic we'll need. From this day forward, we'll never have to do this again. That is my sincere hope. Oops. Okay. That actually looks really stinking good, man. We want to merge her. That. Imagine if I had power out here and I could fly. That'd be so sweet. Okay. I do have this dream to not turn any of this on until everything is ready to go. You know what I mean? Like, like have every single step of this hooked up and double checked. And then once I know that everything is going to go perfect, then I provide power. Just, just hook up one single power pole somewhere back at the base. Just one outlet and then everything out here just starts to work. You know, it starts to, to pump up the oil, the oil goes to the refinery, the refinery makes the, the plastic, the plastic gets popped out here, the heavy oil residue comes out, heavy oil residue goes into that refinery, the refinery turns it into fuel, the fuel starts getting made, the generators kick on, and then all that plastic just finds its way home. And out here we have a little bit of power generation, which is super nice because I'm sure all this takes a poo-poo ton of power. So now that we're going to get fuel from this side... Now that we're getting fuel from this side, it needs to go into a generator. The question is, how many generators? Uh, is that going to be too close? Uh, yeah, a little bit too close. We need a couple of more foundations. We're going we're gonna to hit this thing here. We have some room over there too so we'll make the pipe come out and come down this way or like come out and come down this way and then we'll have generators here to take it like right as it comes off right so we'll have some generators right here i just want to make sure that they're downwind that their input is downwind of both of them so right there is that super duper downwind of both of them not really but it'll be enough all right, now how much do you use a second? Really? You're not going to tell me how much you use a second? Am I going to have to go here? Uh, pipe is input. Oh, the AC is on. Let me go turn the AC off for you guys. Be right back. I'm going to pause the... Uh, I could have swore the last time I was at the other base it told me how much it used per second. I do not know how much it does. Uh, it'd be super nice if somewhere here it tells me how much it's going to produce. Always generates at the set clock speed. Shuts down if fuel requirements are not met. I don't know. We can't have this site back up. You know what I mean? Like we can't have this site. Um, like we can't have the generators. We, we, if we back up, if we're not, if we don't have enough generators and the fuel will back up, if the fuel backs up, then, um, we, we have too much heavy oil residue, which means those things stop, which means the plastic stops. So we really don't have an option. 
we kind of have to over engineer not over engineer but we have to over saturate this area not because we want to because we're greedy or we're not very intelligent but just because we have to make sure that the the balance is met um I turn that that way. Will it behave? Mm, that is a tight fit. That is a tight fit. Let's see how the let's see how the support beam likes it. Uh, we shouldn't have done that yet. We should have one more out here. Okay. Down this way. Is that too close to that one? Kind of is. It's gonna it's gonna pook out a little bit. Not the worst thing in the world. Oh, I think that's way too close to that one. To tell you the truth. Yeah, who 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 thought that was gonna work? Huh? My goodness, it actually does work. That's so funny. I never would have thought. That right there probably should be okay. I knew that was close. Okay, and then do another one of these. One, two, three, four, five. Then I need to connect one of the ones I already put up over here. Perfect. Okay, perfect. That looks great. Um, yep. So now all that's left is to hook up. Did we already hook up the outs? We sure did. So now all that's left is to hook up the uh, this thing here. the plastic out and I suppose we'll just keep walking through the desert I shouldn't have went up that high all right come with me uh, is that level no that, that did go up a little bit too high so not up to step one And that looks like it's going down now. All right. And how are we going to do electricity? Everything is hooked up. Do you guys know what you're making? Did I tell them what they're making? Uh, you don't have the input. But you're making... And you're making residual oil. Okay, let's just double check one more time, make sure everything looks good before we run away from here. So all those guys are hooked up to power. Yep. They all have pipe coming out. All the pipe coming out is hooked up into the refineries. And they're hooked up to the refinery in the amount that they should receive. All those know what they're making. I went through and checked. I'm not going to go check again. On the other side, oh, come on, auto save, you're killing me. Okay, all those pipes are coming out, all the conveyor belts are coming out. Lovely, that pipe comes out, empties over to there. 
And so long as we're burning enough fuel, as long as we're not having a fuel backup, we should be okie dokie. Alright, now this is just going to be impossible to take a conveyor belt out of here. I just don't know if this is the right maneuver here. It's so far away. But we have gone farther. No, 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 we haven't gone farther. We have not gone farther. This, this will be our farthest conveyor belt system. Come on, I see the blue for a second. There it is. Come on, where's the blue? Lovely. Oh, I should have been hooking up power, too, before I made that big jump down. Dummy. Kind of sucks that the uh, the jet only has, like, this little small baby tank. And it's like, oh, you have to fill it up when you land. It's like, no, why don't you just have it hooked into some device that just sucks all the, the fuel out of, of, the, of the tubs of my fuel tanks. That way I can fly. As long as I have fuel, I can fly. I have not done a level four one of these yet. What does it require? Oh, it requires those high speed things. I see. All right. Well, we should have kept some of those in our pocket. Okay. How cool. How cool would it be if there was a conveyor belt slash power pole? Like it was a combo? That'd be friggin' sweet. I'd love that. Does that look good? Yeah, right there on the ground. I love that. Okay, look. I thought we were beyond this. Don't get on my... Don't get on my car. Don't do it. Oh, you have a friend, huh? You guys are so good with that flame breath. You just never miss. Um. Okay. This way. Kind of sucks having to go back and forth between power co connection and then conveyor belt. Like really annoying. Maybe I do this. Maybe I run up with the power pole and I go as far as the power pole will go. And I just turn around and I grab the there's a geyser, by the way. That's one of the new technologies we have. It generates electricity, I think. I could take advantage of that. Bring you up a little bit. Oh look, there's uh, there's one of the miners right now. See, so, yeah, that wasn't so far. I mean, that miner arguably is one of the farthest uh, miners that we have, but I mean, there it is. Wow, we could actually have power pretty soon because that the power connection would go right there. That's great. Um, let's go ahead and try to build a pontoon bridge. And if we ever wanted to change this over to a train, you know, we definitely could use a little bridge like this. When I was taking the flight out here to the vacation home, I watched that movie Snowpiercer. And it's really crazy because I almost never, ever watch movies again. Like, I'll watch a movie one time and then I will not watch it again. Uh, I just, I don't know why, but I just can't do it. But that movie, for some reason, I remember watching it a long time ago. And I thought the, I thought the premise was pretty good. If I watched it again, 
I don't know if it was if it was very well executed, but the premise was okay. Like the people who wanted to get off the train, or the guy who wanted to, like he, apparently their new year is going over a bridge. Some kind of like really big bridge or some beautiful bridge or something. I don't know. It's it's where they celebrate their new year. Um, which is odd because you'd think that they would celebrate the new year from where the train departed. Like your departing station. That would be the... Because, okay, so the train travels around the entire world. And it travels the entire world once every 365 days, right? So one trip on the train equates to one real life trip around the sun but they they celebrate their their new year's day just going over some random bridge in like siberia you would think it would be some bridge you know uh hey there we go all that stuff out there just turned on now we're pumping oil now we're refining the oil we're making the plastic hopefully the I mean, we'll go back out there and check to make sure everything looks good. But as of right now, the time to actually see some product rolling off the line isn't infinity anymore. It's, you know, there's a finite number. But anyway, you would you would think that they would, like, the, the day would be, it would be when they left a train station. You know, like, oh, we left from Boston 10 years ago. Oh, and now we're out of, we gotta do the, Oopsie doodle, didn't mean to do that. Anywho, I was just watching the movie. I thought it was a good movie. Poorly executed. The people who wanted to get off the train, I don't know why. They just didn't wait until they got to, like, uh, to like Africa, where it would be a lot hotter, or the tropics, you know? Um, they waited till. I mean, they, they literally derailed the train and blew up the train somewhere in the mountains, where they were just surrounded by... Like, I mean, this would be the area that if it wasn't, a, uh, uh, oh, got radiated somehow. Anybody? Anybody see the radiate? Okay, there's, ah, I get it. I just don't know the radiation there for some reason. Oh, great. Now we have to fight. They're always behind you. Just walk around for a second. If you ever want to fight those things, just walk around for a second and then just turn around and they'll be behind you. <laughs> There's a slug. But anyway, that's, that's what they did. They, they jumped off the train in the Himalayas. <laughs> I would have just waited and, and planned my coup to be somewhere around. I, I wouldn't say the tropics. I would say someplace it was hot and dry because the tropics, of course, you're going to have the humidity. And if it's freezing, then you're going to have a lot more snow and ice and stuff. I want someplace hot and dry. Man, what a what a line here, man. And I know this looks bad. We'll, we'll come through. We'll come through uh, later, and we'll 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 standardize all this. We should just be happy we're getting more plastic. So that way we can get our our computer thing set up, our computer line. And this thing does not have legs on it. Say that. Oh, no wonder I wasn't running faster. I kept hitting the shift button. Thinking like, why am I not running faster? You have to put the, the legs on. Okay, what is this? Oh, hit seven. There we go. Oh, uh, should I be going this way? Which way, which way do I want to go? I think I want to go to that way. That's, that's the new part of the, the base. I think I want to go that way. The other way was going to a part of the base, like the older part of the base, coming in above where the, the sky elevator is, where the space elevator is. 
this kind of goes more toward where we're at. Actually, shave a little bit of it's right here just by taking this little shortcut. Oh, that's it. I think we're out. Well, this guy might have a little bit of legs left. How much will you go? it for you do I have any other transport I have some of those yep this is a ooh, I just made that a mark one. Oh, lovely come on now there we go perfect how do I get 731 I thought I was out of concrete. Guess I am not. Oh no, I was out of encased beams. Oh, I forgot. I thought I had my my jetpack on. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's do this. Let's go grab the good stuff the encased beams and everything and we'll go back and turn that level one into a decent decent speed uh, conveyor belts oh come on I get so lost in here what are you making You're making reinforced steel beams? Hold on. Are you... No, no, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. One of you guys was making encased beams and you had like a ton of them saved up. What happened? What happened? Did we clear a backlog somewhere and all of a sudden we had like a super duper need for those? You... Modular frames. I don't you don't need to be making modular frames here anymore. We're making modular frames off-site Rotor rotor modular frame modular frame modular frame so we have four modular frames that do not need to be running over here We can definitely Change you into making the encased steel beams because we're going to need those I just hate that we had a huge backlog of encased steel beams, and now we do not. Oh, I guess because we 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 took the. Um, do you need those? No, you don't. You don't need those to make. Look at them. There's so many here. What are they being used for? Nothing. They're being used for nothing. <laughs> no idea why they all those were or why. We had a huge backlog, but all of a sudden they just vanished. No idea. No idea why they just vanished. We're not using them for anything. They are literally not being used for anything. Oh wait, hold on. There they are. There it is. Right there. It goes up. And out. Like everything else in this factory it goes out to just I don't know all right we do not need any more of the of the steel frames being made uh, here we'll change those over when we get all this sorted we'll change those over to um, in case steel beams all right this video has gone on for about an hour and 20 minutes so I'm gonna go ahead and call it here I know it's a little crappy because we want to see the fruits of our labor. We'll have that to look to in the next video. Well, look at that. I was just about to say we'd have that in our next video, but look who showed up. Look who has showed up. The plastic. The plastic from our new uh, our new 
refining facility. Oh, how wonderful. How wonderful. You might as well go ahead and hook it in. It's going to look bad, though. It's going to look bad. Uh, how are we going to hook it in? How are we going to hook it in? It has to feed all the way over there. We're going to take it here and go down that way, and then over. Is that how we're going to do this, or are we just going to go straight this way? I bet we could go straight this way. I bet we could go straight this way. Oh, we don't have that many. Metal plates anymore. We'll run it down that way. And then I'm going to say goodbye to you. Do we have seven? Nope. We have those. I know we have tons of the steel, steel beams. I'll go ahead and steal those right quick. And that will allow us to make... To upgrade that whole entire section into at least Mark 3s. for the tricky part. We're at a metal plate. Uh, da, 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 da. I wanted to call it. I wanted to call the, the video right there, but it looks like we're going to keep working. Looks like we're going to keep on keeping on. So my grandfather used to say, keep on keeping on. But he didn't say it in like a good sense. <laughs> I would always get on his nerves and he'd be like, keep on keeping on, see what happens to you. I feel so bad for the amount of, <laughs> of uh, stress I put my family through. That's an input and that's output. So, so ideally, ideally, we would have a merger block there. I don't know if that's in the cards. But it'll look so bad. It looks so bad just to like shove that in there like that. Right. Alright, well there we go. There's a little bit more plastic coming in from all over the Empire. Uh, that doesn't look that bad. I mean, it's it's, it's a nice, steady amount. That actually looks really good. Go out here right quick and just try to convert this. Is that still level one right there? Maybe that's level one. There we go. At least we're not on level one. At least we're a little bit more than that. But there we go. That looks like a lot of uh, that's a lot of plastic too. That's a good amount of plastic. There we go. So hopefully that'll solve our uh, our plastic problem, and then in the next video we can get our um, we can get our we can uh, relocate our computers production, and then we'll be able to just make millions of computers because we have so much plastic coming in i do want to go grab that that hard drive before i forget you guys want to stay with me stay with me let's go grab that hard drive before we forget 
and we'll put that into our pocket. I know it's far away, and I know you got things to do, but let's just go grab that hard drive before we forget, and then uh, and then we'll get out of here. Then we'll, we'll call the video. I heard scurrying just then. Don't really like the idea of scurrying. Really don't like the idea of scurrying. Man, man, man. Tons of plastic. Really kind of want to know how the the fuel, um, how the generators are doing, the fuel generators. Really kind of want to know how that's going. We're not on batteries. That's a good thing. Da, 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 It's just right there on the other side of the bridge. It's gonna hurt. Oh no, it didn't. I think the uh, I think the switch blades. I think they they cushion you. Like I think they give you a little bit of, of fall protection. I think. Right up here. Come on now, don't be like that. <sighs> there we go. Another hard drive, please and thank you. Okay, now. Now let's just rest for a little bit. Thank you so much for watching the video, folks. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.